Hey y'all, welcome to the Style Chronicles. I almost forgot what I was gonna say, didn't I? Um, to the Style Chronicles. I thought I would do a little bit of a birthday haul with you guys, show you some of the things that I got for my birthday. Um, it's not everything, it's just a couple of things that I picked out that I wanna share with you. First up, um, I Instagrammed a picture of the Tory Burch things, so I'm gonna share with you those. And then, um, it's crazy, they took longer than I thought um, to get here. It's kind of, you know, really, really long time. I placed an order on Tory Burch, and one on seven um, for all mankind the same day, like right after one another. And the seven for all mankind blue jeans that I ordered came in literally like four days after I placed the order. Um, I placed it like on a Thursday, I think, Thursday or, no, it was a Friday night. They were here like by Monday afternoon. So I guess it only took them like two days to get them out. It was crazy, um, the shipping. And then the Tory Burch things took like an extra week. It's been like, yeah, a week and a half um, since I placed the order. So it's just, I don't know if it's me being very, you know, I don't know, I was excited. Maybe I'm just, you know, it took too long. Um, but yeah, I think they took forever. Anyway, first up, I will share with you that I had to get a new phone because my son dunked mine into a glass of water. He just thought it'd be fun to, you know, dunk it in and see what happens. So the battery got shot. So I had to go get a new phone. And I was um, kind of in between the iPhone 5 and the Samsung Galaxy, and I got the Galaxy because I thought it was just way cooler. Um, the screen, bless you, honey, the screen is like way wider, um, and it's just, it's so neat. It's so much more integrative than the actual iPhone. And I read a lot of comparisons on them and um, really, you know, kind of did my research on them. My husband has an iPhone, so I've had experience with that and how it operates, and honestly, this one was just, I think, way better, um, in my opinion, anyway. It's, you can personalize it so much more. I mean, it's really, really neat. And I've got, you know, weather and then Google, a camera app, my ABC 13 for Channel 13, emails, and then, you know, my gallery for my camera, YouTube, I've got Netflix, Instagram, and then I have Instagram apps, which I could never get on my other phone. I could never get apps to change my pictures or edit or anything. So I have all that now. I just think it's really neat. Um, and then, you know, alarms and whatnot. I mean, it's awesome. There's my little pink berry for when I go to pink berry to get yogurt. Um, really cool things that I've never been able to do. And then, you know, just my phone calls and everything. Um, so I really, really like this. What sold me on the camera and the guy told me in the store was the video quality. Um, he said, do you watch movies? And I said, well, I don't, but my kids, you know, that's how I entertain them. And so when he showed me the quality of a uh, movie on here, I was blown away. And then he said, and that's not it. It's got, you know, the best camera available and video camera. And, you know, when he said video, I said, wait, 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 video, it does video. And he's like, yes. And he showed me that. And I thought, that's it. I said, this, I want this phone. I said, I, you know, do YouTube and you sold me on it there. So that's what I got. I'm trying to show you guys one of the one of the movies. Um, this is Avatar. Let me see if I can speed it up. Just so you can see like the quality of the picture. Do you see that? Look how clear it is. And it's big and just beautiful. And the colors, I mean, oh my goodness, it's crazy. Um, so yeah, I'm in love, in love with this phone. There's so much to do on it. You get literally consumed by playing with the phone and apps you get on the phone. I mean, it's crazy, crazy, crazy. Um, so that's that. And then um, I showed you my um, Nook, the Nook HD that my dad got me for my birthday. Well, my sister-in-law, my brother-in-law actually got me a gift card um, for Barnes & Noble. They didn't know that I was getting a Nook. They just got me a gift card, you know, to get some books. And so with that gift card, I was able to make some purchases. I've already pre-ordered two of the books that I've been waiting on, and that's the third um, book in the Crossfire series. I think it's called Entwined to You by Sylvia Day. And then, of course, The Pretty Little Liars 13, which I, I don't know if it's crushed or what it's called. Um, but those both come out June 4th. I've pre-ordered those already. And I placed an order. Or I didn't place an order. I, it's instant. Um, I got another book, and I'll share that with you in a minute. But the cover, too, that I got with that gift certificate was really beautiful. It's called, um, it's well, you know, The New Yorker. It's called The New Yorker. Um, Invisible Man in a suit. And it's just a cover of um, The New Yorker, like a piece of artwork. And then there's the back, and then here's the inside. So it's just really, really pretty. I love it. Um, it's more, you know, to protect it, which I really wanted because I have found myself throwing this in my bag, like, to go somewhere because I play with it in the car when my husband's driving. Uh, and I wanted something that would just protect it. Like, it's already got 
I have a piece of plastic, you know, the screen over it, but it's got fingerprints on it. Um, so there's that, beautiful. And then the book that I wanted to get is this one. It's called Push by Shailene Johnson, which you guys know I'm a turbo fire. I mean, I'm addicted to turbo fire. I'm like a junkie. Um, I absolutely adore it. And it's not loading, but there is the book right there. It's called Push by Shailene Johnson. I wanted it for some time and I just hadn't picked it up. Well, I ordered it on the Nook and it's here. And so I'm excited um, to kind of delve into that book. So that's the other thing that I got for my birthday. Then I will share with you my Seven for All Mankind. I Instagrammed a picture of this too. Blue jeans. They are my new blue jeans. I have another pair. I only have two pairs of sevens. Actually, I have a third pair that are boot cut that's like really old. No, 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 that's lost. No. Um, anyway, so these are the ones I picked up. They're white. They're really pretty white with like, this is silver. Just really, really pretty. And these jeans, I absolutely love them. You know, last year, I was very um, enthused to share the Rockstar jeggings with you from Old Navy. And I still love those. I love those. I wear those to work practically every day. I've got them in a million colors. The Seven for All Mankind ones that I've recently been acquiring, and I want to get another pair in black and another pair in a regular wash because I have a dark wash. I want a regular wash. These are my dressy jeans. These are like my weekend jeans. I absolutely love them. Seriously. They fit like no other jeans I've ever tried on. I just, I mean, I'm in love. Um, and these are the skinny ones. They're called Slim Illusion. That's what they look like. And they... I mean, you know, they're just really, really nice jeans. Now, the Slim Illusion technology uh, that I like about them, and I'll read it to you, it's called Slim Illusion, and it says, lighter, tighter construction, intense stretch, sexy Slim Illusion. Um, and then it's just seven for all mankind. And that's the fit that I get. And I love them. The, um, they're stretchy. They kind of hold you in where you like need it. And for me, I need a lot of shaping in my legs. You guys know I like to work out a lot. I do a lot of squats and lunges and everything. And my legs have always been, that's where I store, um, you know, the largest amount of body fat, I guess. It pretty much all goes to my legs. I have very thick legs. And those jeans just fit my legs very nicely. I like the way they look. Um, when I'm wearing them. So I've got a white pair now and a dark wash and I want to pick up a black pair and a regular wash uh, pair. And then I did mention that I got these on sale. They weren't actually on sale. What it was is a 20% off discount that I had for my birthday that Seven for All Mankind had emailed me. So I used that to get these. These are $198 a pair. They are expensive. I know that. Um, I'm always, hey, stop. I'm always first to admit, you know, when I spend money on something. They are expensive. Um, even with 20% off, it only brought them down to about $148. Um, but for me, they're worth it. I love them. I love how they fit. So, I, you know, I like them. Um, so that's that. Okay. Next up, I will share with you. Hey, my son just decided to make a play thing out of my... No, 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 no. Okay. So here's the Tory Burch haul. Um, first up, a pair of earrings. And I will tell you that these I got with a discount Tory Burch sent me for my birthday. Um, if you're registered on Tory Burch or you, you have made purchases in the past, they send you a discount code for your birthday. And I had, it wasn't a discount code, it was like a $50 credit um, for, your, for my birthday. So I used that to get, dang it, he's not going to stop. I used that to get a pair of earrings that I've been wanting for some time. Um, that were like $68, so I paid the difference, which was $18, and these are the ones. They're just the silver Tory Burch earring. Um, really, really pretty. So that's that, and it comes in a little storage pouch, um, but not bad. I mean, I paid $18 for them, which is pretty cool. And then my husband um, and my daughter, my son, my, my family, got me two pairs of shoes for my birthday. And so I will share those with you. And those are packaged really beautifully. And Tory Burch really does some beautiful, beautiful, beautiful packaging. Um, there's the exterior. And then on the inside, these are the um, sandals. Because I really wanted a pair of sandals that I could wear. Instead of wearing my flats, like last summer I wore my flats all the time. Instead of wearing my flats, I wanted a pair of sandals. And I am not a, um, when it comes to sandals, I'm not a flip-flop person. You will not see me wearing flip-flops. I don't like them. I think if you want to look like you're pulled together, um, like you're, you know, chic, you're dressed nicely, I think a leather sandal with a back strap is the way to go. For me, anyway, that's 
that's how I work. Um, but there's the front. It's really pretty. It's like a luggage color, and then it's got like a gold medallion on it. And that's the new kind of medallion, not the old one. Um, but really, really pretty. Just kind of thong straps. I'm sorry, my son is here. He's messing with everything. Okay, next is the other pair. And these, I wanted another pair of um, Reva's because I wear my black pair and my um, royal tan pair so much that they're getting, you know, they're getting really worn. I wanted another neutral color to wear instead of wearing my royal tan ones all the time. So I picked these. They are snakeskin. I to get them out. It's kind of hard to get out of these bags. Um, and there's the, it's a smaller box than the sandals. They are called, they're natural gold, and they're the Riva Rosia Python print with the metal logo. And here's, they're really, really pretty. They're even prettier in person, just a snake. Um, it does have kind of a black brown and then the neutral tans to it. Really pretty, here's the, there's a the medallion. And once again, it's a newer medallion. It's a little bit more sleek than the um, older Reba medallion. Um, but there's that one. They're just so pretty, so, so pretty. And I'm in love. I am. Oh, yay. Okay. Um, and you guys know these take a while to break in. So I will wear them, but you probably won't really see them in Outfit of the Days for a little while because it takes about, it takes me anyway, a good month. Um, and I don't wear them every day, but a good month to break in a new pair of Rebus because they do need to be broken in. This does hurt. Once you get them broken in, though, they're the most comfortable shoes you will ever have. Um, I know from experience with my other Rebus, they are, I mean, my absolute favorite shoes to wear. They're so comfortable. Okay, hold on. And then um, my husband really wanted me to get a purse, like a Tory Burch bag. And you know, I kind of went back and forth on it. My whole thing is, is if I'm wearing the Rivas or I'm wearing a Tory Burch shoe, I don't want to be carrying a Tory Burch bag at the same time. Because to me, it's like, there's just too much, you know, going on there. I don't know. So I was just kind of like, you know what? I like the bat, the shoes way more than I like the actual purses. Um, so maybe in the future, you'll see me pick up a Tory Burch, you know, bag or something. I would like a little crossbody. Um, something that I can just put like my, you know, lipstick or chapstick money in and my car keys and cell phone, um, which my cell phone is actually pretty big now, so it'll have to fit that. Something, you know, that I can just throw on if I'm going out really quickly or running an errand um, and I don't really need all my kids stuff or anything, you know, excessive. Um, the other thing, too, is because we're looking into traveling more with the kids, going to, you know, theme parks or anything like that, you kind of need something that you can just throw on over your body. So that's what I'm kind of looking more towards getting, um, but not for a while. Like I said, I don't want to mix my shoes with a bag yet because I just think it's too much. I think it's like way, I mean, the earrings, even the earrings, I don't think I'll be able to wear unless I'm not wearing the shoes, if that makes any sense, because I just think it's too much at once. Anyway, my daughter wants me to show you the picture she just drew. It's a watercolor, and Miss Eva is very artistic, so that's, that's beautiful, honey. Thank you. Go put it on the table, because it's going to drip. I don't want it to drip on the floor. Okay, okay that is my um, haul, my birthday haul. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm so sorry for the background noise and the coins that you hear my son and the, yeah, <laughs> he keeps knocking the camera. Um, I use my husband's coin sorter as my tripod when I'm filming. And he obviously has been messing with those coins throughout this video, so I apologize for that. Anyhow, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far. On my Bye. face, I have on um, Max Cream Cup lipstick, and then I've got satin taupe in my crease, or in my on my lid, and then I have Mylar around that. Um, my cheeks, I've got Elf's Cream Blush and Lemonade. It's like a little cream stick all over color stick, I think, in lemonade, and then just powder over that. So that is it. Hope you guys are having a wonderful week so far, or the beginning of a wonderful week. Um, it's hot here. It was cold for two days. It's hot here. I am obviously still sick. I don't even know what to say anymore because it seems like as soon as we get better, we get sick again. My son um, just had a birthday last week, his birthday party should have been this weekend, but we really did not do anything for him because he actually had chicken pox. Isn't that crazy? He had chicken pox. A very mild case of chicken pox, but they were chicken pox. So we really didn't want to have um, my cousins and all, you know, my family over with the little kids because I, we didn't want to expose anybody to anything that they should have been exposed to. So we didn't do anything for him um, for his birthday. But that was that. Hope you guys are having a great start to your week. Talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.